Hi, this is Matt with EVH Gear. Here to show you the new 2017 introductions. First, let's start with the black and yellow Wolfgang Special out of our North American facility. This is the black and yellow finish. A lot of people out there think these are graphics. I just want to stress this is painted. All of our stripe models in the line are painted. Nothing's graphic. So this has an arch top basswood body, FRT 01000, chrome bridge, D-Tuna, direct mount Wolfgang pickups, black bobbins, Borns low friction EVH pot, high friction tone, set it, forget it, bump it, doesn't move as easy, okay? You have your thumb wheel butt adjust on the neck, easy access, lefty, loosey, righty, tidy for adjustments, quarter sawn maple neck, compound radius, 12 to 16, jumbo frets. Three-way toggle, R2 nut, chrome hardware, black headstock. Okay, moving on to the EVH 5150 guitar. This is the first guitar in the Stripe Series line that is a satin finish. This also has a different striped pattern than our original. Okay, so this one has been in development for a while. Getting the stripe pattern correct, sourcing these topped um, mounted decals was something that we uh, took a while to do um, in order to get it right. Uh, Eddie Van Halen back in the day, he uh, went to a truck stop and found these numbers and uh, put them on his guitar. Um, and so we took some time to source them and, and finally got it right. So we have it there. This is the last process of the guitar that's right on top of the finish. Okay, also have one right there. And not a lot of people know that the original guitar had one right there. Okay, so this is a basswood body, as is the Wolfgang Special that we just spoke about. This has a direct mount, Wolfgang pickup, black bobbins, FRT 01000, D-Tuna, low friction, EVH Borns pot, quarter saw neck, compound radius, 12 to 16, jumbo frets. This is a different body style. It's offset from what we originally did on the Stripe series, okay? We also have a different headstock that we did. Also different logo, offset placement. This has an R3 nut. This is a little bit wider than the Wolfgang's. This is standard. On the back, Stinger, originally on the, on the 5150 guitar. Cool. Next piece is, this is done out of our USA Corona facility. EVH Wolfgang Edward Van Halen signature models. Okay, people have seen him play this on tour. It's his trusted stealth model. Originally, they come out with black hardware, but Ed wanted something a little different for the tour. He uh, put chrome hardware for the bridge, chrome hardware for the nut, left the tuners black. It opens it up, it's a little bit brighter. This has tendency to sound a little bit darker with the satin finish, so forth, and the way that we apply the finish. So with these added features, it just sounded good for him. But also, to add, recently in the past, we've uh, added a different pickup, and this is gonna go for both models. All the Wolfgang, pickups in all of our models uh, have Alnico 3, I'm sorry, Alnico 2 magnets. These ones feature Alnico 3 on the neck only, just in these. You also get the kill switch, stutter switch there, low friction volume pot, high friction tone, FRT 01000, D-Tuna. The stealth model features an ebony fingerboard with vintage stainless steel frets and dots. Quarter saw neck, five ply binding, one thing people don't know is our tilt back headstock on these. Most tilt backs have a scarf joint. This is made out of one piece of wood, all the maple. So in order to get that, you use one piece of wood in order to get that. All the Edward Van Halen signature models will feature the eye hooks installed, dog clasp, and the strap, just like he uses. This is all exact. Ivory finish is gloss, block inlays, same features binding, so forth. Okay, last but not least, LBX2. Last year we released the LBX1, it was 15 watts and it featured the famous blue and red channels. This one features green and blue as well as dual concentric knobs. This allows you to set both gain and volume for each channel separately and independently. So I could have my gain on my clean low, my gain on my blue higher, 
my volume on my clean a little higher because it pushes less, so I need it to match up with my blue. And there, so now when I switch, you get even volumes, no jump, perfect for stage, perfect for bedroom, perfect for live, whatever you want, okay? This is 15 watts, all tube, two EL84 JJs, four 12AX7 JJs, 15 pounds, features a white cage, black front, as opposed to the LBX1 had a black cage and a white front. On the back, it features a master resonance knob for added bass response. It has an all tube effects loop. It has a quarter switch to go from 15 watts to 3.5 watts as well. That's what's new for 2017.